Hello, boys and girls. I want to go over lesson 3.9 with you. And this is today's lesson, which is Monday, October 19th. And we are going to be on page 129. And we are going to go all the way to 130. And we will stop there because you will be bringing this book back with you. And we will finish page 131 and 132 in class. So again, you are only doing 129 and 130, and you will bring your book back and we will do the rest in class. All right, so first of all, I wanna show, um, talk to you about how we are going to look at this page and start with coloring some counters. So you're gonna need a red and a blue marker or a crayon or a color pencil whatever you have, so red and blue, all right? So once you have the red and blue crayon or marker or color pencil, you are going to draw the counters that you need for this math sentence. So you are going to have six red blocks and seven blue blocks. So we want to show that we can count all of these together, but just by making a 10, and then we're gonna write the sum. So first of all, I'm going to use the larger number, which is the seven, because I can fill in seven blue counters. So I'm going to draw seven blue counters. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So now I need to draw six red counters, but I have three empty spaces in the 10 frame. So I'm going to put three of my red counters in the 10 frame. So I have one, two, and three. But I still need more because I need six red counters. So I have one, two, three, one, two, three more, so one, two, three, four, five, six. That would make six total red counters. So now I'm gonna look here and see what is the total amount that I have. So we know that this is already a 10 frame because we've already filled in the 10 frame. So we can look at this math sentence and we can rewrite it and rewrite it to 10, because this is a 10 frame, 10, plus how many do we have left? Three, and 10 plus three equals 13. Good. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we are gonna turn the page to page 130. We are gonna turn the page to 130. So now we're looking at what is nine plus six? So again, if we look at the picture, we do have nine yellow counters and six red counters. So now we are going to take one of those red counters and we are gonna fill in that 10 uh, frame because we, we wanna fill that 10 frame in to make it easier for us to add. So we filled in that 10 frame. Now I only have how many counters outside of the 10 frame? I have one, two, three, four, five. So if I have 10 in the 10 frame plus five, that makes it a lot easier for us to add. So 10 plus five equals 15. Therefore, six plus nine also equals 15. I'm gonna do one more with you and then you will do the rest on your own. So I have eight plus four. So I have already, we already in our book, they were nice enough to do this for us. So we already have two of the counters that filled in the empty spots of our 10 frame. So now I have eight plus the two more that they added. And that would equal 10 because we have now a full 10 frame. Now we have two that are left over outside. So that would be 10 plus two, and 10 plus two boys and girls equals 
12. So what that means is that 8 plus 4 also equals 12. All right, so you are going to do this one on your own, and then you will pause there, and then you will bring your book back, and we will continue on Tuesday. And I'm super excited to see you. Thank you.